Hey man. <clears throat> hey man, you think about jumping on in that shit, man? At Anibal, man. Goddamn, fucking Anibal. You wanna build you some muscle the quickest way possible, man? That's good, man. It's real good that you wanna build muscle. But I think you should stay away from the juice, man. You can talk to him about that. Yeah, man. Anibal. Shit was made in like 1960 something. Yeah, they say it's the man. I'm fucking going again, man. Say it's like the uh, it's the probably the safest, safest steroid. It's even safe enough for uh, women to take. Yeah, even women take it. A lot of fitness models, women takes it because they want to. What's that thing they say that turns it from a woman to a man? They, it's a saying. I was reading on some steroid blog. It defeminized. D D. Uh, Why you use words you can't even fucking pronounce? Oh no, defeminize. So, yeah, is that even a word? Turn them into a man, cause when a female takes steroids, once they get those man attributes, more yeah, than not, they the, don't go back. The clit, the clit will actually turn into a small mushroom tip. Yeah, and they get this mad uh, raspy voice. Once you get that, if you're a female, it doesn't go away. Yeah, it doesn't. Ninety percent of the time. It's funny when you see them pro female bodybuilders. Oh, I don't take steroids. You talk to them, they sound like fucking me. <laughs> Like, I never touched them. Well, you do fucking throat exercises, do that shit to your fucking boss. But look here, Anibal. You're like, hey, hey, girl, hey, man, I was thinking about hitting that shit, man, but I just looked at your damn groin area, man. You got a damn lump bigger than my fucking lump in my pants, man. What you hiding in there, man? You got a small You got mushroom. mushroom tip inside there? Look here, Anibal, safe as steroids. Yeah, it, it, I've done some research on it. Yeah, it is. Safe as steroids. It's the mildest one. But it's not for like putting on a lot of mass. You're not gonna put on a lot of mass with Anavar. Yeah. It says you'll put on a lot. Uh, you'll make some strength gains. <clears throat> and uh, but it will it will do like give you some of the side effects that the other steroids do, like fucking lower your normal testosterone production. And it's funny, man. Some blocks say it does. Some blocks say it don't. Yeah. You know, it's mixed information about that particular. Everybody says it's the safest. A lot of people say. It. It suppressed their testosterone. A lot of people say it did. You Look, know. whatever gains you could get with Anavar, you can get it naturally. It's a mild steroid. Yeah. They actually uh, recommend it for people that's like AIDS and people that's real sick losing weight. They give it to those people to keep them from losing weight, gain back that weight. But whatever you get with Anavar, you can definitely get natural. Don't even fucking waste your time and money with it. Anavar pretty much is a fat cutting steroid anyway. It would have been perfect for my three year transformation. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Should have been perfect, but keeping it natural over here. Well, if I was to take anything like that, as soon as I pop that pill, man, I would have all kinds of fucking anxiety. Something don't feel right, man. Oh, man, it's that fucking steroid, man. I got too much in anxiety to take some shit like that. After that one time, I, uh, we fucking uh, tried that shit Mark McGuire said he took. Yeah. I got them bad fucking uh, results. I said, you lying motherfucker. That was like when I was 19, though. Yeah. But uh, I'm 37. It's been a while. I was young and naive. I didn't have a fucking YouTube channel I could watch and get advice. I don't think YouTube was, I don't even think YouTube was around yet. But, uh. <coughs> yeah, guys. If you think about buying Anavar, don't even waste your time and money. It's a fat cutting steroid. You get strength gains, but Hurts. not much of any size. And it is toxic. Not All the steroids. Are not bad. as toxic as the other ones, but it is hard on your liver too if you abuse it. So, don't pickle your fucking liver. It's just advice, fellas. Stay away from it. Do it naturally. Eat sound foods. Work out hard. Get your rest. Take you longer, but you'll get there. All point of working out is being healthy, right? Not really. <laughs> but look here, that's just advice, fellas. Do whatever the fuck you wanna do! Hunch twins, bitches.